Good evening, myself and Bose. It is Sunday, July the 1st of July 2012. That's here it is, and today you might notice something different. Today I'm shooting on my DSLR, my Canon EOS 550D, not my iPhone, because right now I'm doing the product review, something I haven't done in a while. So this won't be a regular vlog. This will be a review of what's in this bag. You'll find out what's in this small bag in just a second. Or you could read the title, you know, anything goes. Today, we're reviewing a product that I got from eBay for $10 called the new N-E-E-W-E-R, I don't know how to pronounce that. It's a wide angle adapter that you put onto the end of your 1855 kit Canon lens um, that comes with most DSLRs now. Um, and you just screw it onto the filter thread on the end, the filter thread's 58mm. I'm sure you can get a bunch of other ones. Uh, for other lenses, that there would be Nikon ones and all that jazz, but today we're just going to focus on this one. So, inside the small, cute little uh, carrot case that it comes with, we have the adapter itself. Okay, so let's, um, let's inspect this. So one here, you have two lens caps. There's one on this side that's just made out of some rubbery material, and then you have one that actually screws onto the filter thread on the other side and then that just screws on to the lens itself so let's um, see how that goes okay so I've got the adapter right here um, glass actually seems relatively nice for ten dollars but we'll see how it looks on camera whoops kick the tripod righto here we go so just got the end of this it will go out of focus a bit so don't establish your focus before doing this because you're touching the focus ring and it will kind of degrade that because you're touching it and then it'll go all out of focus and dick. Alright, here we are. Um, you'll see an immediate change in how wide the lens is. It seems seems pretty good. Yeah, all is well. Um, except for a bit of vignetting around the side, but that can be easily fixed by zooming in slightly and you've still got a relatively wide shot, or at least wider than the 18mm shot that you had before. You'll notice in the corners, like that destructible cow poster I have up there, might be a little bit distorted, but that's expectable when you buy $10 glass. But still, for that, I reckon it's pretty good. If you're into, you know, maybe skating, um, videography or photography, this might be good. Uh, it's a bit cheaper than a fisheye lens because it's not a special kind of lens, but it's still relatively wide. But yeah, for the price this company's selling it for, I recommend getting it for its 10 bucks, and it's a lot wider now, so... I quite like that, and you don't have to buy a wide-angle lens. Sure, a wide-angle lens would be better than this, but you also don't want to pay, you know, $1,200 on a 10mm L lens. So I find this to be a pretty good substitute for that until I can afford something else. So if you're an amateur videographer or photographer using your Canon EOS camera with a 18-55mm lens or something else with a 58mm thread, I strongly recommend getting this because it's pretty sweet. Here's some um, wide angle shots of stuff to keep you amused. 